A very good afternoon to you. This is a Tech Guru. Today we're going to be looking at how to split your screen in Windows 10 for multitasking. Now the Windows Snap Assist feature has been around for some time on Windows itself, but quite a lot of people don't know about it. So I just wanted to share this video with you today so you too can benefit from this great little feature. Okay, so we're going to dive right into the detail now on how to split your screen in Windows 10 for multitasking. Okay, so in order for the Snap Assist feature to work, you need to actually make sure that multitasking is turned on on your Windows 10 computer. So if you go to the desktop, as you can see here, and select the Windows Start button at the bottom left hand side and then go up to where it's got settings as you can see here. If you select that and then the settings window is open, if you type in multitasking here and as you start to type you can see that multitasking settings appears. What you need to do in order for this snapping function to work is you need to actually make sure that where it's under snap windows that this feature is actually turned on. As you can see in our case it is. There are some other functions here where you can turn them on and off like where our snap window automatically sized to fit all, fit available space etc. The other two options I always make sure those three are ticked. Okay so let's go on to demonstrate now how to actually split the windows for multitasking. Okay so now the snap assist feature has been set up it's just a case of now we open the programs on the screen. So today we're actually going to have four different windows open so we're occupying different quarters of the screen as I'll go on to demonstrate now. So the crucial thing initially is select your program or the first one that you want to open and position and you need to make sure initially it's the full screen when it's opened okay. So what you need to then do is move the mouse up to the top bar of the screen and if you click and hold down the left hand mouse button and then pull it away from the top and then it's just a case of dragging it across to the position of the screen that you actually want the window to appear in. So in our case we're going to go for the right hand top corner so if you gently drag it across holding the mouse down still and you'll see that snapping feature appear there for that's for the right hand side of the screen half as you can see there but we're doing quarters so because we want quarters we're then dragging it up slightly still holding the left hand mouse button down and when you see that feature appear in the background there you can see that's the top right hand quarter just literally let the left hand mouse button go and it's just a case of repeating that okay so we go to windows explorer here top hand top bar again with the mouse holding the left hand of the mouse button down and then just dragging it across to the side initially the left side and then to the top right and release and it's just a case of doing that one thing i love about this feature is that you don't have to spend countless hours repositioning or resizing the windows which is what I used to do which is why I wanted to share this with you today. So just a great little feature and obviously it's easy then to work on the screens afterwards. So if we have the spreadsheet again full screen and then we reduce the size, snap window appearing and then just pulling it down and you can see and release. And then on here you'll see that you've because I've got the more than one window additionally open it gives you different options I'm recording the screen here today but uh, I'm going to finally do this spreadsheet for example like that so again so we can compare the information so if we literally drag it to the right hand side as you can see there and then pull it down gradually and release and there you go it's all snapped into place I've also put together some other popular computer related videos just like this one where I share a bunch of helpful tips. Be sure to check these out. You can click on these now. Thank you so much for watching our video today on how to split your screen in Windows 10 for multitasking. We'll see you on the next video.